one more corner, but it's only a little flick right. Does Frames fancy the lunge? Oh, oh look up from D'Ambrosio! Oh, no, he slides out one. wide, but he holds on to win in Marrakesh! <laughs> I love you guys! Sixth on the grid, Jerome D'Ambrosio, slightly disappointed to be that far back. There's a dart to the inside, look at that. What a decisive move from Jerome D'Ambrosio. But there's D'Ambrosio forcing his way up the inside as well. Oh, late in the day. Jerome D'Ambrosio is up into third position and up into second place has gone Jerome D'Ambrosio. And he's come out just in front of Sebastian Buemi. It's victory for Degrassi and for well Aft. Well Jerome D'Ambrosio has his first podium of the year in second. How was fantastic all weekend, so we got to keep that momentum and do a strong finish of the championship. D'Ambrosio comes across the line, he goes quickest, 15, 498, decent lap. And a big lockup, it's not going to be pole position for Buemi, it's going to be Jerome D'Ambrosio <laughs> who will start from pole position. Here comes Sebastian Buemi through on Jerome D'Ambrosio. Buemi leads into turn 17. A third place finish. Another podium for D'Ambrosio. Oh, he's up by 4,000 and he's locked up and he's missed it. Surely that's it. It's Jerome D'Ambrosio, the Belgian, who takes his second Formula E pole position. And he said, yeah, do what you got to do and uh, try to keep it in one piece though. And I said, I'll try to. And I just went for it. All five lights are on, and we go green in Mexico City. And let's see who gets the best start on the run down towards turn number one. Sam Bird looking up the inside of Sarazan. D'Ambrosio's got the lead covered, and D'Ambrosio covers the inside line. And Degrassi still tries to look to the inside line. So close between them. Degrassi locks up, manages to get it stopped in time. Here comes Buemi up the inside, coming down into one. Oh, Here comes Sebastian Buemi, tries to squeeze up the inside. Goodness me, how close between the two of them there. Buemi's going to look to the inside. Oh, he's into the back of him. They come together and they go both straight over the chicane. Jesus, he completely crashed into me. But here comes Sebastian Buemi. Right under the wheels. And it's side by side for second. In the end, the race was fantastic. You know, I give, I give everything I had. <laughs> very funny, very funny. Oh, look at these two! The, team the two Dragon Racing Faraday Future cars. And at the moment, it's D'Ambrosio who's in front of Duval. They're in their own little race, really. They nearly came together in Season 2 in Beijing. And uh, meanwhile, Oliver Turvey is now behind Daniel App. There's been a change for 8th place. Here comes Duval, jinking one way, jinking the other way. D'Ambrosio locks up. These two are really laughing around. Remember Daniel Lapp, China when they yeah. almost came together. Daniel Lapp looked behind and in front of Turvey. Oh, so the touch. up into eight. Goodness me. Jay Penske, the team boss of the Faraday Future Dragon Racing team, is going to be interested I in this. Give some a raise. <laughs> <laughs> That's mega. Well, you, you never know until the contract is signed if you're going to be driving for sure, but I never really had doubts. We had the opportunity to make something happen now and we did, so really happy about it. Definitely the ambition is to go and try to win, uh, to win the races and to fight for the title.
lights are on. And we go green in Marrakech. Good start from Bird. Also good start from Sebastian Buemi. He might be able to challenge Bird on the run down into the first corner. Bird goes for it out of nowhere. And there comes D'Ambrosio up the inside of Lucas Degrassi. D'Ambrosio up the inside and forces his way past Sam Bird. No, Bird manages to hold on. Here we go, he's going outside. Oh, and he Touched. moves over on him. A little bit of contact. Oh, Sims going for the lead. Up the inside goes Sims, oh. and DaCosta's ah, locked up! What are you doing? They hit each other, DaCosta's in the wall, and the lead is gone! And the Mahindra team are in the lead of the race! What? DaCosta's and out! Going. Come on! The final lap of the Marrakesh E3 begins. Jerome D'Ambrosio leading, Frace in second. This nose to tail for the lead. One more corner, but it's only a little flick right. Does Frames fancy the lunch? Oh, oh look up from D'Ambrosio! Oh, no. He it's slides out wide, but he holds on to win in Marrakesh! Well done, mate! Well done, mate! <laughs> I love you guys! I love Mahindra! Yes! Why did you kill me? Yes! Yes! Ah! That felt amazing. I mean, you guys know I've been here since the start. I've been fighting, you know, to be in this position and I'm just thankful to the team.